or it wafted o'er the table, and it bobbled over baby, and it wafted him away. Mabel ducked for cover as the bubble bobbled over, and she shouted out for mother, who was putting up her hair. Mother came out on the double at the very sound of trouble. Saw the bubble for a minute with the baby bobbing in it as it bibble bobbled and it wafted o'er the fence. In her garden, Krista Gribble, she began to cry and quibble, for her lazy brother Rebel was asleeping in the bed. But she shouted, Gracious Gravel, and she groveled in the gravel as the baby in the bubble wibble wobbled overhead. In his garden, Teddy Tribble and his jolly mother, Sibyl, sat and played a game of Scrabble, laughing loudly as they scored. But they both began to falter and to babble at the scrabble as the baby in the bubble came up bobbing over the board. And a crumpled Mr. Copple and his wife, a crabby couple, set out arm in arm to hobble slowly down the lane. But the baby in the bubble set their hobble to a joggle as they raced away like rockets, and they never limped again. And a nimble Mrs. Threeble in a muddle with her needle, matching pink and purple patches for a pretty patchwork quilt, heard her older sister tell her, throw your quilt upon your shoulder, and she bolted after baby in a tattered tartan quilt. At the market, Throngs of people saw the babe head towards the steeple, and the chaplain and the choir quickly exited the church. And Walter Snyder from the choir quickly went up towards the spire, took a pebble from his pocket and a very hearty sling, and he slung the pebble at the, the bubble and he burst the bubble and the baby in the bubble tipped and tumbled, swayed and lurched. And Krista, Mabel, Gravel, and a jogger, not a slogger, quickly swiveled and divested Mrs. Treble of her quilt. And with calculated patchwork, baby bounced onto the patchwork. And he wiggled, and he giggled, and he wiggled with delight. And the chaplain was dumbfounded as the baby bounced, and the he rebounded. And soon the babe was grounded, and the mother held him tight. The end.